what's up guys today august the 17 2016 today i want to talk about my other truck that i just bought it's a toyota tundra as you can see it right there and the dash dakota right there the dash dakota i love the dash dakota but the reason i bought the other tundra is because once this breaks down i'm gonna have a backup truck that's why i bought it and i always wanted a tundra because that's the kind of truck that i depends on it's a good truck and it'll last for a long time toyotas are good trucks you can count on them and let's let's take a look well some of you guys remember where i talk about that i didn't have no truck no utility trailer not enough not even equipments that's in part three that's where i was working two jobs seven days straight to 12 hour shift and i work my ass out hard and i have three kids too i have three little boys and my wife she was my wife she wasn't working i'm the only one managed to pay everything bills rent take care of the, the three little boys of mine i love them to death and i managed to live for a year like that but i worked my ass off for a year just to save for truck because with a truck you can do a lot of stuff and now I got what I always wanted, so I quit that job like in the in I think I quit that job in April, so I came back here in Alabama to continue the longer what I always wanted to do. So let's take a look at the trucks. Here is the Toyota Tundra. It's a 2007 model. It's an older model, 2007. Actually, I bought it from this guy. He's the uh, original owner, so I'm the second owner right now. It has like 117 miles on it, and I pay like $12,000 cash money. It's been good. It's been taken good care of, as you can see. It. It's the SR5 5.7 liter V8. And here's the other Dodge Dakota. It's a 2002 Dodge Dakota 4.7 liter B8. Why about the other trucks? I just bought it because it has more power and I need a backup truck anyway. And I have three kids so no matter what, I'm going to use this one for my kids, for the family, for the job too. And I bought a utility trailer 7 by 14 It's a double axle. These are all my equipments. I paid 1700 for this trailer right here. It has double axle, 7,000 pound, dovetail tail with 3 feet gate and they add some bars on this utility tray right here they add some little bars for like heavy duty gate gas it doesn't look heavy duty to me but the reason i got this dovetail because i don't want a big i don't want no big gate they so heavy so i decide to go with the shorter shorter gate and with a spare mount tire Recess jack. I'm thinking about adding another bar here under underneath it that support this one coming down from here or underneath it. I'm not sure yet. But this is what my my setup looks like in 2016. And this is for all my equipment. This is my dad John Deere right here. It's my dad and we use it as a homeowner because he got a big yard and this is the one we started our landscape with he used this one and then well i started out in my little toyota camry trunk but we bought this one 
and this is the aqua in 2014 it's an old model i'm definitely gonna upgrade to another new one either a steel or an echo i'm not sure and i need an etcher as you can see i don't have no etcher here this is my billy go back in professional this honda right here i bought it in 2014 it's like two years old and it's still running like a beast i paid like 400 for that one the billy go is 135 from garage sale And this is steel SG20, my gas tank, steel Magnum BR600, steel HS45, and this is my first blower right here. This is my first blower that I start my landscape with, and and the push mover right there too. So, all oh, this blower right here is the new upgrade. And this is my chainsaw that I bought like two years ago too. It's the it's the big though, MS311. That thing right here will cut anything. Okay, this is my setup in 2016. What I need right now is a zero turn and I'm on the way to go get the money. Yay. All I need is a zero turn. That's it. I got everything now. Alright, that's it guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, hit the button, comment below. Thank you. You guys been supporting me through the beginning. And this is my setup in 2016. I can't wait to get a sale return so I can go out there and make some money like you guys. And these are my homeboys right here. These are my sons, the other baby in the in the room. This is Joseph and Joe right here. Yeah, you wanna get down? You wanna get down? This is my older son right here. He's three years old, and this one is two. Okay, thanks for watching. And I forgot to mention my dad' new trailer too. So he updated another new trailer. Actually, my sister bought it from him, so he needed a new trailer. We started out with a little one, and now we're upgrading everything. Me and my dad, we work together, so my sister looked out for him. And I'm going to show you guys this new trailer. This is that new trailer right here. I think it's a 5 by 10 It's a dovetail, same as mine too. Actually, it look it looked like he got a bigger gate than mine. He can fit a serotron here and two push mover. Not like the other one. You can only fit a serotron and one push mover. Let me show you guys where his other other little trailer at. And that got a new serotron. Actually, we found this one on a garage sale for nine hundred bucks. And he and the owner said he only used it like 10 times and he, he moved, he upgraded to another bigger serotron because he got a big, big yard. This is his Toro right here, it's, a, it's the time cutter. And it's the 42 inch deck, Z4200. So that's the reason he let me borrow his John Deere for a while and I'm I'm gonna upgrade to a zero turn this fall or either in the beginning of 2016 I mean in the beginning of 2017 that's gonna be my year that's it guys thank you for watching